As soon as you meet another woman on a bike, that's your sister. You have a connection to anybody else on a motorcycle, but like when it's another woman, it's another level. Motor Girl started in 2004. I was kind of challenged with how the community would accept me. Would, would men sort of take me seriously? You know, I'm not a technician by trade. As a matter of fact, I graduated with a CS and BS from SUNY Buffalo and I was a computer programmer for 10 years. And it wasn't until after the dot-com bust that I needed to sort of look for an alternative job. And I said, why not? work on my hobby. I felt taken advantage of uh, in various motorcycle dealerships or in independent garages. You know, they thought that women didn't really know about motorcycles, so I felt like one year a guy who I asked to change my tires gave me used tires and may have polished them and I was not very happy with the work that I had gotten, so I wanted to start working on bikes myself. Motor Girl was devised to be a community garage where people could come in and work on their motorcycles. There aren't too many places that are women specific where they're embraced and welcomed. And it's not to say that men don't embrace and welcome women, they're so happy to have women in their shops. But it's a different vibe. It's not about mansplaining. It's not about trying to act like an authority. In a place like this, everyone's an equal. So it's a place about learning and community that really draws women together. Community involvement means that you have a place to come in and ask questions, you know, um, a place where you can sort of start learning. When I was riding, I didn't have that, and that's all I really wanted. So I felt that if that's what I really wanted, perhaps others also wanted that. I wanted a place where people could teach me. We're one of the sort of pioneers in this community workshop program or business model. We have not only hobbyists, but technicians who are really interested in supporting that business model as well. So we're really excited to bring that to the community. I've been coming to Motor Girl myself for about five years now. I started coming on the back of somebody's bike as a passenger and Val is the one who kind of took me under her wing and made me realize that like motorcycles are for everybody and there's nothing that's going to make you feel as strong or as powerful or as free as you will at the throttle of a motorcycle. It's a very comfortable place to be to have all these other women around you that are willing to just drop everything and help you. And again, somewhere where they can ask questions and uh, be able to recycle their oil or be able to recycle their battery or just may not have the right tool for the job. So for $25 a month, you can do that here. So I think our price point it differs us from uh, other areas in the country as well as the fact that um, it's probably run by a female. We're seeing this evolution of women really getting involved and really creating their own communities. So uh, this kind of model that Moto Girl has here, I could just see exploding across the US and also the world. There's other countries where motorcycling's enormous and huge. And this, this is a perfect way to scale up and across the country. It's a sense of, of commonality, a sense of, you know, I have a place where I can start.